Hello family, welcome back to our channel. Happy Sunday to you guys. I just got back from the grocery store and had to pick up some fruit and a few items. Uh, I will be getting my meat probably Saturday because I'm going to Food Giant and oh my God, uh, Rouse's and get my meat. But I did get a few meats just for this week or whatever and the rest is vegetables and fruits and stuff for Philip lunch. And I still have a few more items that I have to go pick up this evening and I got some seafood. So I'm about to share that with you guys. So if y'all interested, please stick around. Please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. Comment in the comment section as well. So let's go ahead on and jump into this guys. All right, you guys, I'm going to start over here. I had to re-record this because it was getting confusing for me. I'm going to tell you guys first what I got from Claiborne Hills. It'll be easier because I didn't get that much from out of there. I got some breaded chicken tenders, and these are already seasoned. These are the ones that they, they season them up in the store and package them. These are the ones that they have in a deli counter. And the kids, everybody likes these. And I forgot to get the dinner rolls. So I'll pick up a thing of dinner rolls that we always get when we have these, the Hawaiian ones, but they're the in-store Hawaiian rolls. And I forgot them. I forgot to get them. But anyway, they were $7.99, but if you get a pack of smoked sausage, it was 50% off. So I only ended up paying $4 for this pack, and I did get the, um, the insulin smoked sausage, and it was $12.99. I got, but those two, I got from Claiborne. And then moving over here, I got my bread from Claiborne Hills. It was 79 cents a piece. I got my red beans and rice and my butter beans, black eyed peas, and the red bean seasoning from Claiborne Hills. That's why I said this would make so much sense for me to just share you guys what I got from there first. And my red beans and rice was, I mean not the red beans and rice, the red beans was Four for five dollars for just the camellia red beans, and it's all the camellia brand. And any other beans, butter beans, black eyed peas, black beans, as long as the camellia brand, they was a dollar a pack. So I got a black eyed pea and a butter bean, and then I got the red bean seasoning. And usually these are on sale two for a dollar fifty, but they had a deal today. If you buy two at regular price, which is only one fifty nine, you get a free bag of sugar, a four pound bag of sugar. So I got that, and that's what came from Claiborne. I think that's all that came from Claiborne. Oh, and my sandwiches, and I got these sandwiches right here because that's for today's game. So that's what I got from Claiborne, you guys. So jumping into what came from Walmart, I got the General Mills birthday cake cookie crisp. All of the kids will eat that. I already know. I got the granulate, the water sugar. It is the 10 pound bag, the Welch's grape jelly, and the Peter Pan peanut butter. The peanut butter was, and this one is the honey roast creamy. This one was on sale today for $3 and some change. And this was on sale for like a dollar and something. So I went on and got that instead of doing the mixed PB and J that because Philip Alicia said I should have got Jif, but Jif wasn't on sale. And I know they'll still all eat that. Um and it was cheaper than doing the PB and J mix, the smuckers. And then I got the coffee creamer. And since it's getting when it start getting cool, cool, I'll start doing like this the different flavors. But for right now, I'll just do the original one because I'm not a big coffee drinker and my mom doesn't do the flavored creamers. I do. She doesn't. So I always just get her the original. I'll start drinking coffee once it get cool here. Cause it, it, yeah, we really don't have much of a fall. Our fall doesn't start until the end of November. And um so yeah. <laughs> Uh, we got, I got a Louisiana hot sauce. I got the Nesquik, a thing of potatoes. It's a 10 pound bag of potatoes. And we're going to head over here. I got the sweet onions. They didn't have any Vidalia onions. They was out of them, but it is the same thing. So I got a thing of onions, sweet onions. I got three cucumbers, my celery and my onions. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to save me some coins by cutting them up myself. And, um, you know. As I need them. And I do have a big thing of the 8 count bell peppers that I have in my deep freezer. So I didn't need any of those. I got one head of lettuce for right now. A 3 count tomatoes. Two 
cantaloupes because I am going to cut these up and this will go and fill up lunch and he will also bring some celery with peanut butter I know some schools you can't bring peanut butter because of people who have nut allergies but the way because Philip has to bring his lunch and he has to have peanut butter for his protein he'll always sit on the other side with the other kids um the way they just separated a certain way so the kids will never be around each other or by each other and then I have I got a thing of plums the bag is bust because I ate one already a thing of black pepper I got some cheesecake jello and french vanilla jello well, it's the pudding. And then I got one of the French vanilla cake mix because I am making a banana pudding dump cake. I do know how to make banana pudding from scratch and a cake from scratch. But it's game day and it's 1047 right now. We're having seafood. So I got to start on my seafood ball. So I'm taking this help where I can today. But for Thanksgiving and Christmas, I'll do it homemade. I got a thing of red seedless grapes. I do like the green ones, but my baby boy, Philip can no longer eat them. So I'm not even going to buy them and tempt him with them. So I'm just getting the red seedless, the ambrosia apples, because they're the sweetest. And that's what our family like. I got two things of bananas because he can bring all of this stuff for his lunch. I got the red sliced apples for my daughter, Alicia, because she also has to bring her lunch to school. Philip likes both. Alicia will just do the slice because since she has just got her braces off not long ago, it's still hard for her to bite into the actual apple. Um, because her gums are still a little, yeah. <laughs> I got four things of the ABC um, spaghettis for Philip on those evenings when I didn't cook and he can come home and grab a quick snack. Some strawberries, <laughs> a thing of uh, bacon, and this bacon was on sale at Walmart for like. Three dollars and some change. The hot dogs. I got y'all know I always get the forty count because Philip does bring these to school, and then they like beans and weenies. I got one pack of cheese because they still have one pack in there. The boathouse form. Myself, Alicia, and Riante drinks these. The small ones was cheap. Then you just get an apple, baby. Okay, well, eat you. Can you uh, put that back? Cause you need that for school. Get you some grapes. Or you can have a, yeah, get you some grapes or eat the banana, okay? Thank you. Um, but yeah, they, around here, I put these in her smoothie. Me and Alicia just drink them. They didn't have the um, mango at the store that I went to in my other city, but they do have the mango in this size in my city, but I just didn't go to mine today. So I'm going to get the big one and the mango because the small one, you just seem like you waste more money getting the small ones if you have to buy them for multiple people. When I go to Sam's, I'm going to get the real big one from Sam's. Go wash that grape off, pudding pie. Oh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> He's just dropping them. Not pulling off and washing off. And you will be bringing all this stuff to school, okay? All right, I already shared this with you guys. My, I got spicy chicken patties for the older kids because they'll like they'll fix these for a quick meal. And then I got the regular chicken patties. I like the John Soul Food ones. They are good. And then, of course, the chicken nuggets for Philip. He will be bringing those to lunch as well. I got the 20-pound boneless skinless chicken breast. And I will be, when I get the rest of my meats, I will get the chicken wings. But I get those from Food Giant because it's only like $14 for a 20-pound bag. And then I did get the 10-pound one. And I will be getting me some more ground beef from Food Giant when I go. But these was really the only meats I needed for this week. And then moving on over here. French toast sticks. Philip will also bring these for lunch as well. As my daughter Riante, she sees for breakfast before she goes to work because she's usually the first one up in the morning getting her lunch because she has to breakfast and lunch made because she has to be out super early. And then she gets these as well. Milk. I got two more gallons. If you guys watch my vlogs, you all know that I said that Philip cannot have any more any kind of juice that has any color into it unless it's a pineapple coconut lemon anything clear apple juice so i'm going to get him some more of these they only had one of these left at walmart on a shelf so i got him this one and i like these because it's better than just getting a hawaiian punch or you know stuff like that because this actually has um the va splash it has the oxidant antioxidant C, B, and vitamins. So that'll help him, you know, try to push him wherever you can. I got the dull peaches and strawberry gel for him. 
and then the dull mixation and the apple strawberry. You're welcome, baby, because he can take these for lunch. <laughs> I got one thing of fruit snacks, and he can't have any chocolates either, so he can only do fruit snacks, Skittles, stuff like that. Imperial butter, okay? <laughs> I got two of the four packs, and I'm so glad now that they put it in the canister. So I don't have to get that blue bonnet anymore. So yes, come through Imperial. Mm, yes. And I love I love that butter, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, I love it. I got the fruit shoot. And this is this is my first time seeing this in my Walmart. I don't know when they started carrying it. I know Claiborne Hills used to have this, but it was expensive. But this is the first time I've seen it in my Walmart that I go to. And it's the fruit shoot hydro raspberry and apple. Made for kids, zero sugar, zero calories. And since it's clear, you can drink them. And then they, I know they had another brand that I have seen before. Um, and it's pretty much the same, uh, like the fruit water. It's just, you know, a different brand. And it's cheaper because this was only like $1.89 for a six pack. So I got two. And then this one here is the fruit shoot sparkling hydro strawberry and raspberry. And I'm going back, um, I guess I'll go tomorrow and pick him up a few more, but I didn't have any more room in my basket. I got one of the Glade lemons to go in my bathroom, the Glade sugar plum fantasies. This smell good, y'all. And then a small thing of doing dish detergent, the chicken. I got Philip two of the chicken nuggets. It sh that charger should be in my room. It should be in my room up against that wall. And then I got Rayante, two of the turkey. The turkey, she bring hers to work. I got also got him the cheese dip breadsticks because he can bring these, one of these in his lunchbox. Pringles is $1.44. The great value is $0.98 cent at my Walmart. So I got him the cheddar cheese Pringles. <laughs> okay. And he didn't care when I showed him to him. He was like, Mama, Pringles are Pringles. So... Hey, he's seven. He don't care. And then I got the great val uh the sour cream and onion one. He loves these Chex Mix, and all the family does as well. I'm gonna go back to the dollar store and get another one for the game. But I'll put these as a um a snack for him. And also he loves pretzels because since he can't do Doritos anymore or Cheetos because the of the artificial cheese. So I know that really sucks for him. He can do the plain chips, but he'll get bored with the plain chips. So yeah. So I'm just trying to come up with some different little ideas and things to do with him. And I can also do the white, take these pretzels and do like the white chocolate because he can have white chocolate. So I'm going to just add a little white chocolate to some of these to kind of spice some things up for him. And let me see. I, that may be everything, you guys. Um... Make sure I named everything. I tell you guys, we are going to have sandwich today. Um, let's see. i show you my ground beef. Oh, I got one thing of Cokes, another thing of water. And you guys know, I just went and bought two things of water. I got one on the floor, one in my room. And I did put some on that shelf over there. And then I got my shrimp for today. Because we will be having a shrimp ball with potatoes and corn. I don't think that man tied that bag up as well. And I got, I think it was like four and a half pounds for $30. And I did not think that was bad. And I'm going to go ahead on and just pour them in the sink. Hold on a second, baby. I'm going to go ahead on and pour them in the sink. And pass them. See how many I got. And well, it was actually like 26 with tax. But. I thought that one, that's a lot. So yeah, and they have good size and it's a lot of them in there, you all. It's a lot. So yeah, so that's what we having today, Trump. Um, I was gonna do some crabs too, but we're having gumbo next Sunday. <laughs> And I didn't want to do shrimps and crab and all of that stuff today. Then turn around and have it next Sunday. I know some people be like, why? Because we eat seafood all during the week. So that's what we got today. So that's what we're having. So I'm about to start on that. Make sure I have, yeah, I got enough crab boil. My daughter made some cinnamon rolls. So I'm about to go ahead on and get, oh, and I got me one of these little sun kiss. 
And I'm going back and get Philip these because he can drink the peach. So I'm going to go to the dollar store and just pick him up a few of those. So, yeah. So I think I got everything covered. I will be going back Friday to, like I said, Food Giant and get some more meats and get a few more fruits and vegetables. Uh, I don't have to do any canned vegetables or nothing because I'm doing all frozen and fresh. I'm not saying that's all I'm going to do, but I have canned vegetables. My cabinet is stocked up with vegetables. So I'm going to do some frozen vegetables and get some more green onions and celery. Pick her up some more fruits and stuff to bring to school. But this will be enough for the week. Tell them bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, please go ahead on and hit that subscribe button and the bell. So you will not miss any of our notifications. So I'm finna tend to her issue because she's looking for the charger for that laptop and get my groceries put up so I can start cooking. And if y'all are interested in seeing how I do my crab ball, I well how I'm gonna fix my shrimp boil. I will be doing that on my other channel. It's listed in the description link below. It's Alicia's life. And I also will be doing my banana cream i mean my banana pudding dump cake over there on that channel as well so i'll see you guys later y'all have a great day be blessed you guys